Tiger Woods in the news. According to the police report, Gina, the legendary golfer was found at the wheel of his Mercedes, passed out at the wheel. But then the test showed that there was no signs of alcohol. The car had two flat tires. It had a broken tail light and a mangled bumper. One of, the ti one of Tiger's major sponsors, Nike, says it's sticking with him. In a statement, the company said this, we can confirm there is no change in our relationship with Tiger. Is this a smart move, Gina? It's their only move right now, Maria. There, there's no proof that he's done anything wrong. I, I, I realize that he has a very sketchy past. He's done some not-so-nice things uh, in his life. But at this point, there was no blood alcohol content. There's no proof that he did anything wrong. And in fact, maybe he should be held up as a hero for this particular move in that he had the sense, for whatever reason, whether it was pain medication or whatever, to pull over and get off the road, which is a really important thing to do if you're not feeling right for whatever reason yeah. and so um, you know clearly we hope he'd get a driver next time but I certainly don't think you can uh, you know convict a man for something when there's zero evidence that he actually did anything intentionally wrong at yeah. all. Kevin, you want to wait? Yeah, I, I think it's tough because he, uh, Nike actually is probably making this move because they want to show athletes that they're going to stand by them. They're pouring a lot of money behind them. They know they're, uh, th they are human. Uh, the issue here, though, is that he did have two flat tires, so was he driving? Maybe the he got rims off were damaged. The rims were damaged. So maybe he, uh, that's why he stopped. Yeah, if you're, so if you're it's behind, too hard to If tell. you are under the influence of anything and are behind the wheel of an automobile, even if the, the car is in park, you are, they will charge you with a DUI. You're on behind the wheel. Again, the per taking personal responsibility is not driving in the first place, right. period. I'm Knowing sorry, that you're taking prescription yeah. medication. Well, where's his driver with all, you know, with all his wealth? Right. <laughs> well, well said. Nike money can pay for a driver. Yeah. And Nike yeah. didn't exactly. cut him loose after that wreck and all the ensuing details that he, came out he about makes his about extra forty-five marital. million dollars after a in, in sponsorships. Yeah. In Thanksgiving '09, when he had that, that that accident out in front of his house, and we found out the life that he was really leading, Nike still stood by him even after that. Mm. So if, if Nike, of course, Nike's going to stand by him. Now. They stood by Lance Armstrong for years as Lance Armstrong was doping and destroying people's people's lives who accused him of doing just that thing. So they did. They stood by Nike might might want to reevaluate. Dr. Gina Loudon, good to see you. Thanks so much for weighing in. Great to be with you. Thank Appreciate you. Appreciate it, Gina. Thank you. Coming up